looking through to the next round that was really, really satisfying afternoon? Yeah, um, I think the biggest thing for me, and you know me by now, is a reaction of coming off the back of a, a game we didn't deserve to lose during the week, but we did. And I said to the players before the game and after the game on Tuesday that you know if we've ever had a setback, it's how we react. And I thought the reaction today was excellent. Um, I thought we, we started the game bright. Um, then we just kind of went into a bit of panic mode and stopped playing. And, you know, so I... Um, I don't really lose it very much in a dressing room or, or raise my voice because I, I like to keep calm. Um, but I just felt it needed it at half time today because I didn't want the same to happen today, what happened on Tuesday. And I thought the lads come out in the second half, took it on board. You know, on a difficult pitch, it's bobbly, you know, we're kicking, kicking up hills, a fair slope. Um, and I thought they dealt with it really well. And I thought oh, we were brave second half, we looked to play. Um, you know, we didn't get it right all the time, but you know, for me, they were they were looking to do the right things, which really, really pleased pleased me. And, and the braver you are, the luckier you get. And you know, Jao's got his goal, second goal, fantastic, and that that just took a little bit of pressure off us. But then, you know, how many bad decisions I've seen given in this league? It's it's absolutely laughable. And you know, yet another one's gone against us today with a penalty. Um, but the lads dug in at the end and, and dealt with everything that they threw. Us, and I think we thoroughly deserve to go through. No other players play today who may be looking for a few more minutes under the belt. Sam and Jao win two of them and they both scores. And I guess that's exactly the sort of reaction you're looking for. Yeah, you know, it's. I said to them after the game Tuesday, you know, some players will be really disappointed that, that they're not getting the minutes they would like. But, you know, that's football. I've had to deal with it in my career. And, you know, players have to deal with it. It's how you react again. And, and today was an opportunity for those players that haven't had minutes to to show me that they should be in the team. And I thought, you know, they did that. And, and Roger got his goal and Jao got his goal. Um, so, you know, the good thing as well, we've got no injuries in there, so, you know, it's, I can't really afford to have too many more injuries, because uh, we've picked up a fair few after Tuesday. Um, so, you know, all round really pleased with the players that have come in, they've got some tired legs in there, but I think particular praise for, for Callum Ross today, I thought he was man of the match by far. He's, it looked like he hasn't been out injured and you know his, his leadership qualities, he's brave on the ball, he's reading in the game, he's breaking up the play, um, was, was outstanding today so credit to him. And Callum Moss is one player that you haven't had the chance to select in your time at the club as well, did he show today what you've been missing over these last yeah, few months? Yeah, I've only ever seen clips of Cal, you know, it's, um, I've seen him in training but there's no substitute. Callum's one of the fittest people I've ever seen but i seen him stretching his calves 10 minutes towards the end there for maybe a touch of cramp and it, it just goes to show, you know, game situations are completely different. So to be able to see him today in a full, you know, um, match competition, I thought he was outstanding and to, 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 to put the performance he needed after being out for so long. Uh, his attitude has been first class and today he was outstanding. Now we move on to Tuesday, another competition, the Durham Challenge Cup. Is that going to be another opportunity for you to maybe have a look at a few players that haven't had a lot of minutes, maybe a few younger players as well? Yeah, maybe, yeah, yeah, of course. Um, you know, it's the trophy today. Of course, we've got the big big one next Saturday, so my focus will be, you know, I'm not saying I'm not focused on Tuesday, but it will, we'll pick a team, you know, whether we throw a load of youngsters in, but, you know, I wasn't able to put field five subs today because we've got a lot of, you know, a lot of players that, that have got injuries that might not make next Saturday and, and important players in, in Gary Liddle, uh, Connor Newton, um, who else have I left here? You'll have to help me along. Lewis here. Alessandro. Lewis Alessandro, yeah. Josh Doherty. Um, you know, we've got some real key players that might not even feature next week. So, I, you know, it's delighting that I've been able to get uh, 90 minutes under the belt for the lads. So, they, they, you know, they need to be ready for next week if called upon. So, you know, I don't really want to pick any more injuries up on Tuesday. Um, so, we'll, we'll assess the squad this week and, and see, see, what, see what I do.